This math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says 5 minus 1 in parentheses times negative 3 minus 15 divided by negative 5 equals. So in order to answer a question like this, we have to use what's called the order of operations. The order of operations tell you the order in which to work out this problem. Now there's a few ways you can remember the order of operations. Some people remember it using the mnemonic device, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally, but I like to use the acronym PEMDAS. That is to say, this says you work out what's in parentheses first, exponents next if there are any, multiplication and division as they appear in the expression from left to right, that is to say they're treated as equals, and then addition and subtraction as they appear in the expression from left to right, that is to say they're also treated as equals. So again, on the ASVAB and PyCat, you're not permitted to use a calculator or a reference sheet. And for that reason, I recommend you get in the habit of copying things down and working them out on your own scratch paper. As we look at this expression, you should see that uh, we do have something in parentheses, notably 5 minus 1. So that's the very first thing we're going to work on. 5 minus 1 is 4. So this becomes 4 times negative 3 minus 15 divided by negative 5. And now as we look at this expression, you can see that we have three operations left. We have multiplication, notably 4 times negative 3, subtraction, minus 15, and then division uh, divided by negative 5. So according to the order of operations, we're going to do multiplication and division before subtraction. More specifically, we're going to do multiplication and division as they appear in the expression from left to right. So on the left-hand side of this expression, we have 4 times negative 3, so that's what we're going to work out first. 4 times negative 3 is going to be negative 12. Again, a positive times a negative is a negative. So this is negative 12 minus 15 divided by negative 5. All right, so we have two operations left, notably subtraction here and division here. Of course, we're going to do division before our subtraction. So let's work that out now. And I'm going to read this as negative 15 divided by negative 5. So this becomes negative 12. A negative divided by a negative is going to be a positive. So negative 15 divided by negative 5 is going to be positive 3. Now we only have one operation left, notably negative 12 plus 3, which is going to be negative 9. So the answer to this one is A, negative 9.